Frugal fam, it's Mia here, and welcome back to A Little For A Lot. If it's your first time, thanks for stopping by, because today I have some of the easiest, most beautiful and decadent DIYs for weddings and home decor, using all items from Dollar Tree. Let's get into it. For this first DIY, you'll need a cylinder glass base, silver diamond wrap, one floating candle, and one microfiber duster pad. You will also need a glue gun and scissors. Measure the diming wrap around the bottom of the vase. Be sure to have three to four rows of diamond wrap overlapping so it will glue easier. And don't worry, the rows will glue and fit seamlessly. Cut along the side of the diamond wrap, not the diamonds themselves. Once you have it cut, measure out another strip of the same length. This will go at the top of the vase. Add glue to the back of one strip and place it on the vase. Once that's secure, tightly wrap the ribbon around the bottom of the glass. The diamonds in the ribbon should line up perfectly. Then add glue on the top of the ribbon where you just glued and attach the rest of the ribbon. Do the exact same thing to the top of the vase, making sure that the overlapped ribbon is aligned with the ribbon at the bottom. Now take the microfiber duster pad and cut off the white tag on the inside. These outer edges of the inner white pad is where you'll add the glue. When it comes to gluing things, I always like to do a dry run. So I wrapped it around the vase horizontally. And as you can see, it's a perfect fit with just enough room for the ribbon to show on each end. You just have to keep it snug to give a seamless fit in the end. I love how Dollar Tree's products are made to fit each other and this is a perfect example. Glue this exactly like the ribbon, starting with two rows of hot glue on the short side of the white pad, not the furry part. I aligned the overlapping part of the fur with the overlapping part of the ribbon. Once that's set and secure, add glue to the other side and wrap it around tightly. It's okay if the fur is overlapping, the goal is to make sure the outline of the white pad is as close to the other side as it can be. Once that's dried, fluff the overlapping fur to your liking. See, you can barely see it. Add some water and a floating candle and it comes out beautifully. You can also add some flowers. I added some white roses to this to see how it would look. Perfect for a wedding dining table spread, centerpiece, or as home decor. I was inspired to make these two next Dollar Tree DIYs from this scene on Love is Blind Season 3 when SK proposed to Raven. This next DIY is the simplest and it's glueless. You'll need a cylinder glass face, two sheets of silver adhesive wrap, and a floating candle. The easiest way to attach this is vertically. Make sure the adhesive wrap is all the way down at the bottom of the glass. As you peel off the paper, Smooth the wrap onto the glass so there are no air bubbles. Cut off the excess adhesive wrap, leaving about two to three rows of the diamond wrap at the top. Wrap the excess wrap down into the inside of the vase. Take the other sheet, peel off some of the paper, and align it with the other diamond rows. It should align perfectly. Slowly smooth it out against the glass until you reach the other side. Cut where the diamonds align and smooth the wrap down against the glass. Leave out two to three excess rows and stick it inside the glass. And there you have it, a blinged out vase. A LED pillar candle fits perfectly inside and it's absolutely gorgeous. 
This next DIY is super easy. Take a margarita glass from Dollar Tree, turn it upside down, add a lot of hot glue, and glue on the blinged out vase on top to make a high-end candle stand. Add the LED pillar candle to make the perfect centerpiece for wedding tables. You can put these anywhere to give a high-end expensive look. This next DIY is a classic and it's glueless. Take a cylinder vase, a short glass candlestick, one rose tea light candle, and one plain flameless tea light candle. Place the candlestick in the glass. The rose candle flashes in blue, red, and green, and I want a more classic look, so carefully remove the rose part from the candle. And it fits right over the regular tea light candle. Place that in the glass candle stand, and you're done. This is great for centerpieces and matches an elegant wedding ambiance. For this DIY, you'll need an essentials white basket and two microfiber duster pads and hot glue. Put your glue along the lines of the rectangular pad on the inside of the microfiber pad. Line up the top of the pad with the rim of the basket and press the sides around the basket to glue. Once that's set, repeat with the second side. I found it easier to solely roll this side to glue it on. Make sure the edges are as close to each other as possible. And there it is, a furry and fluffy diva basket. You can use this basket for anything, makeup, toiletries, and it holds a lot. Totally loved how this turns out and can't wait to put it in my room. And to add an easy handle to your diva basket, grab this viral headband from Dollar Tree and place it right over the basket. No glue necessary. Now this handle is for decor, but isn't it cute? And the basket doesn't even stretch out the headband. I hope you enjoyed my Dollar Tree DIYs. I had a blast making these and love how they look around my house. Which ones are you going to try? Let me know in the comments. I wanna hear how they turned out. If you like what you see, please hit that like button and subscribe. Until next time on A Little or a lot. Taking a chance.